Hello and welcome to the Learning React JS course by Eduonix. My name is Brad Traversy and I'll be your instructor for this course. So this course is going to be on React JS, which is a JavaScript library, and we'll be looking at React from start to finish through slides, examples, and projects. And just to give you some information about the course, there's seven chapters. Each chapter will have three to five sections. Each section will include a video and any documents, work files, and quizzes that belong to that section. All right, and the last chapter will be a project. So what should you know before taking this course? Well, you should know some HTML and CSS. Um, probably should know at least, the, at least JavaScript basics, um, how to create a function, variables, uh, maybe loops, stuff like that jQuery is definitely not required but it will help you out and basic programming logic again things like loops functions variables arrays this will all help you out and I'm not going to say that you positively must have all of these or or any of these to take the course because you you very may well be able to do it just knowing HTML so some of the technology and concepts that we'll be touching on is front-end UI development all right so react is all about the view which is the part of the application that the user sees um, view rendering will be uh, using many types of JavaScript methods application state uh, user interface design JSX which stands for uh, JavaScript syntax extension and is a big part of react uh, data binding and data flow virtual DOM. React actually creates its own little virtual uh, doc document object model to work with. We'll be learning about that. Uh, components. React is all about components making um, composable software that can be reused um, in the same application or maybe even in other applications. Okay and we'll also look at Node.js and Express just a little bit because we're going to be dealing with the server um, just like I said just a little bit um, if you don't know anything about Node.js or Express that's absolutely fine so chapter overview uh, chapter one will be just getting started with react we'll set up our environment we'll talk about what react is uh, chapter two will be about react and JavaScript extension which is basically it's it's an XML like uh, syntax that is used with react chapter three will be about states, properties, and methods. Chapter four will be working with data. So we'll, we'll also learn how to make Ajax calls uh, using jQuery, bringing that data into React, uh, and also posting data to a server. Chapter five, we'll talk about some of the React add-ons that are available, as well as the Flux architecture. Uh, chapter six will be about running React on the server because React can run on both the client and the server. And then in chapter seven, we're gonna create uh, a project called GitHub Profiles that can uh, send some Ajax requests to the GitHub API and bring that info back and we'll display it in the UI. All right, so that's a summary of what this course is about. Hopefully you enjoy it and learn a lot and I look forward to the first chapter.